for its much-anticipated second book, Monocle, in collaboration with Gestalten, turns its hand to one of the magazine's most enduring themes, good business. This book is different for a variety of reasons. The first thing is that it's just, it's visual. And I would say 99% of the time when you pick up a business book, it is black text on white pages. There might be the odd graph. But there's never a visual narrative which excites and stimulates you. What's so important about this book, uh, and, and it makes it unique in the business section, is that we guide you, we show you what good business actually looks like, not just what it sounds like. I think this book is for anybody who wants to start a business. And it's also for people who perhaps will never run a business but kind of dream about it. So there's a bit of escapism in there as well. I think you can look at the lives that some of these people have turned around for themselves. People have left city jobs to go and become farmers. And you think, yeah, maybe one day, perhaps you'll never do it, but there's some dreams in there as well. The first steps are really kind of, let's go right to inspiration. Here's 20 people who have done it, whose journeys through the world of entrepreneurship have taken them to all sorts of places. And then we move into a kind of a, the life course of a business, you know, from having that, oh, I've got an idea, through to actually putting your feet up on the beach at the end of a few years and thinking, do you know, I think I might have kind of made it here. So we're going to give you that kick up the backside, push you on your way. After you put this book down, you think, I've got no excuses. I just kind of need to do this thing I've been talking about for ages. I think the people who have got a business plan half written in their drawer will think, OK, this is the day I finish it off and I'm going to see my bank manager tomorrow. Forget the management speak, quick fixes and tales of untold riches. This is not a book about staging a revolution. It's a book about doing things well, from how you run the show to how you kit out your perfect workplace, find funding and where in the world to do it. Inspiration is always good because it, it creates an emotional element. So you want inspiration. You want to be, you want to be insp aspiring. But at the same time, it is absolutely mandatory to just really get to know how things are being done. What we're trying to do is really trying to step a little back and look what's really happening, what's really important, and give our sort of ideas and insights to the reader. With original photography and illustrations, and printed on a selection of high-quality papers, Monocle's Guide to Good Business is the ultimate reference for inspirational ways to improve your livelihood. What you're going to see is a classic bit of monocle design. It's the core fonts, it's the core kind of tactile touch points that monocle has. It's the paper stock, it's the linen, it's the foil treatment on the cover. And an elegant approach to classic bookmaking. And that is something that you don't see in books about business. I firmly believe in paper and I think people still love paper. I think people still love books. I think people still love to collect. You don't collect websites, you don't collect digital experiences. Of course they're important, but really you don't covet them, you don't give them as gifts, and I think a book is a much more lasting experience, and I think this book will last a long, long time. Readers will get Monocle's take on the steps to striking out on your own, why apprenticeships matter, why it's good to take your dog to work, and some surprising lessons to keep you in the black and upbeat. We're not saying, look, here's the magic of success. It's not one of those business books you'd find in an airport. This is a book saying some of these routes that we're suggesting to you will probably mean you earn less money than you do now. You may have to leave a big job in the city to kind of start running a small shop. But hey, you're going to have a better standard of life in many ways because you'll be in charge, you'll be deciding what you do. This isn't about kind of get rich quick. This is about get happy slower. There's this interesting dovetail between the book and I think also how we run our own business. And from the very beginning, the business plan for Monocle has always focused on getting out there. We knew that we had to be witness to what was going on in the world. You have to go and see it and smell it and immerse yourself in the environment. And that's what the book tries to do, short of that. We're delivering you a visual experience. We're taking you to those places. But the call to action at the end of the book is get on a plane, see it, do it, breathe it, live it. Monocle's Guide to Good Business is published by Gestalten and is on sale from September at all good bookstores and on monocle.com.